Hi, I'm Bonnie Beat. Tonight on Video Wave, we'll be talking to Patricia Morrison from Sisters of Mercy. Hi, Patricia. Hi, Bonnie. Thanks for joining me here in New York from London. Thanks for having me here. Sisters of Mercy have three videos right now. We're going to talk about them chronologically, the first one being this corrosion. This corrosion was a great hit in England. You know, it went to number seven on the British charts. And uh, let's, before we take a look, let me ask you what it was like to film that. Well, what we had originally wanted was to go to Bangkok, and we wanted the video to look very apocalyptic and decayed, mm -hmm. but yet Andrew and I to be unscathed through it all. Um, the record company didn't want to give us money and a crew and plane tickets and send us off to Bangkok, and I think we can understand <laughs> where his killings in that. It was probably a good idea not to do that. <laughs> so anyway, we did it in a studio just outside of London, and it worked well. Were you really wet when you were shooting? We were day? very wet, and was there was steam coming up from below, and it was cold was and Was it clammy. uncomfortable? How long did it take you to shoot that under those conditions? It, it was... It equaled out to about 18 hours. Really? And all in one day? Or yes, did you do it all in one day. Of a couple days. Day. Okay, now let's take a look at this corrosion. You just saw this corrosion from the Sisters of Mercy, their first single off of their LP, Floodland. Second video, my favorite. It's called Dominion. This is this great story. Correct me if I'm wrong. The first video ever to be shot in Jordan? Yes. Is that right? Wait till you see this. Tell us about it. Well, Jordan, first of all, is in the Middle East, right near Syria. And we were a day's tank fighting from the Gaza Strip. But despite all that, it was a uh, the location, we didn't pick it because of that, we picked it because of Petra, which is this ancient city. It's just amazing. It's all carved out of stone, and that's what you see in the video. What's, how, what do you know of the history of Petra, the Rose Red City? Is that right? Yes. Um, what did you learn? Did you do your homework <coughs> before you went out there? No, I didn't know exactly what it was, just another a monument to something that's long since disappeared but you can feel it alive. And the Bedouins, which are also in the video with us on the horses, they still live throughout that city uh -huh. and up in the hills in the desert. It was at one time 50,000 people. Wow. And it was in, oh, it's, it's, there's no words. It's one of those things that there's no words that can do it just, it's really amazing. We'll have a chance to take a look in just a minute. But before we do, one of the things I want to point out is a favorite scene of mine when you were riding on a horse with your hair back. You seem to be a good horse person, a good horsewoman. Are you skilled in that or did you have to? I am now. Yeah? <laughs> did I knew you have that to train to do that? I mean, did No, I lied is what I did and said that I could do it because I knew that the video would look better if it had me uh -huh. on one of the horses right. rather than just the Bedouins. <laughs> so I lied and prayed and <laughs> <laughs> it worked. That's great. It worked so and it was great. you have been riding for a while no. and you just got up and, no, that was it. and the horse cooperated happily with you? As yeah. You? Yeah. Well, I... For one thing, they're small horses. They're Arabians, but they're, they're quite small, so that's not that intimidating. If they'd been English horses or something, yeah. it might have been different. But no, it was great. I enjoyed making that video, and I think you can see I enjoyed making yeah. it. I mean, who wouldn't, for days, in just this most unearthly atmosphere, they put you on a horse and say, go ride. <laughs> it was great. That's great. So a little bit better conditions than this corrosion. Yeah. That's also, also what we wanted was the opposite of this corrosion. Yeah, tell me a little bit about why you chose to make a dif that different look. Um, it fit the song, and I think people that make videos should always keep the song in mind. I think a lot of people don't, mm -hmm. and we try to do that, but there's still so many ideas that haven't been used, and I think we've proven that with the videos we've done. There's still things I can think of that I'd like to do that I haven't seen anywhere. It's great. It's really beautiful. And, let's take a look. You just saw Dominion, really one of my favorite videos ever from the Sisters of Mercy, off of their Floodland LP. I'm talking to Patricia Morrison, and she just let us know, if you're just now tuning in, that that was filmed in Jordan, in Petra. And now, another exotic location for the third video, Lucretia, My Reflection, which was a song written for you, is that right? Yes, yes. Andrew wrote that for me, sort of a welcome aboard song. And uh, the video really has nothing to do with that that it was written for me, but the, uh, there's a coldness to it, a coldness to Lucretia, yes. that, that relates to me in it, and 
that's why we wanted a cold atmosphere as far as steel. Mm -hmm. And once again, the opposite of what we did in Dominion. And any location would have done, it didn't matter that we went to India, but Andrew wouldn't have done the video unless we gave him a ticket to somewhere interesting. Yeah. <laughs> now, we originally wanted to go to Russia, and that was set up, and because now Russia is opening up, believe it or not, we were kept out because things have to be sorted. It was, mm -hmm. There was no political reason why we were kept out, rather than things were opening up so much that we were stuck right in the middle of it. So we couldn't go to Russia, and at the last minute, we said, what are we going to do? And we had a choice of a few places, and we all wanted to go to India, so that's how we ended up there. Now, we should have thought that this is a third world country. Yeah. And we thought, well, no one's ever made a video in India. Mm -hmm. There's a reason. <laughs> just, you can't. It's quite impossible. It was, it was very, very difficult. Everything from the film boiling because of the heat uh -huh. to as soon as we walked out of the hotel, there was um, 10, 100, 500, 1,000 people right there like that. And they have nothing. They have nothing to do, nowhere to live, so they're content to stand there and stare at you forever. Were they amazed by Westerners, or was it part of the, the rock image, your image, that fascinated them? I don't think they even understand that. I just looked like I had landed from another planet. Yeah. <laughs> I was so completely out of anything yeah. that they'd ever seen. Yeah. It had nothing to do with music. They would ask, are you a star, or are you famous, mm -hmm. or whatever. But it was an incredible experience, and all of us really came away feeling differently. What time of the year was it that it was so hot? Did well, it's always hot this? there, oh. and it was in, um, I can't even remember what month it was in now, but two days later the monsoon was supposed to happen, oh, no. so it was really hot and really humid. Were you in Calcutta, or did you say Bombay? Is that right? No, what we city? were in Bombay, Bombay, which is the most affluent city mm -hmm. in India, which is unbelievable considering it's a city of eight million people, and most of them live on the streets. And the factory itself was? It was a cotton mill. A cotton mill? A cotton mill. Was great. And for that, I wasn't even allowed in the mill because the workers would stop and just stare. So for Andrew to be able to do his filming, I had to be kept on a bus for eight hours oh, in the heat. All day. Yeah. And it was. The video, I don't know looking back on it whether the video was worth going to India for, what we have on film, but I wouldn't have missed it for anything. I know none mm -hmm. of us would have. No, it's Why the choice to shoot this video in India? Is it cheaper to work out there? Don't you like that? Yes. Is it truly that Andrew needs inspiration of the foreign too. country? <laughs> that too. He wanted something, which I can see that. And I mean, I jumped at it also as soon uh -huh. as they said, you can do it, of course, you know, mm -hmm. rather than go into a studio. But a studio in London costs a lot more than yeah. going to India and doing that. What was it like? Um, there was one segment that you were outside of the factory walking along a boardwalk. What that was, there's a causeway that goes out to a temple. Uh -huh. It's multi-religious, this temple at the end of this causeway. And that's where the lepers and the beggars and everyone who has any sort of disease hangs out there. And they let you out on the causeway, but they don't let you back. Yeah. And I was walking along that. <laughs> and when I came back, I sat down in the bus and they said, are you all right? And I said, yeah, I'm fine. And, th and then everyone noticed I didn't talk for five hours. Oh. It was really incredible. Do you, do you uh, would, would you ever think of going back there? Not to the south. To see not to the south. There's nothing you can do about it. Handing someone money doesn't do anything. It's purely political. Yes. And that country, I mean, it's an affluent third world country. They have the bomb. That's yeah. a frightening thought. But there's nothing you can do about it. The north is supposed to be lovely. Kathmandu and everything. And that was, we'd thought of doing that, but I don't know, I don't really know how we ended up in Bombay. As a matter of fact, we were at the airport leaving the crew thought we were going to Delhi and they didn't know we were going to Bombay until they saw the tags on the luggage. <laughs> it was like and then were they concerned? No, no. They thought, oh, it's just a Sisters of Mercy video. We should go <laughs> along with it. Who knows what they'll do to us it's, this time. It's got to be exotic. Exactly. Yeah. All right, let's take a look. This next video is Lucretia, My Reflection. You just saw Lucretia, my reflection from the Sisters of Mercy, and I'd like to thank Patricia Morrison for joining here on Video Wave my in pleasure, London Bonnie. on her way to California, where, where she will be working with Andrew on the new record, we hope. And um, also to mention that they've got another video that we hope to see here on Video Wave soon called Night from 1959, one of the other tracks, off of Floodland. 
So we will hope to take a look. That one you also shot in India while you were over there? Yes, yes. Okay, so we will hope to take a look on that. Currently only available in England, so we'll see if we can bring it to the United States of America. I hope we can. So, formerly Pat Bag of the Gun Club, <laughs> now Patricia uh, Morrison of Sisters of Mercy onwards. And thank you again. Okay, thank you, Bonnie. Have a great night. You too.